All right, so I'm getting ready to go fishing. Um, going to the creek, haven't been to the creek in a while. It may be too flooded, but I'm gonna go see. But I want you to see what I have on. So I have on a t-shirt, shorts, and boots. Yep, I'm doing it. I really don't care. I don't care what those people think about me. I really don't care. All I care about is catching some fish. I'm gonna start with a rebel floating minnow jerk bait looking um, thing and I know I can catch them on spinner baits is why I catch them on every time but I want to try something different. If I'm not catch I'm being honest if I'm not catching anything within the first 10 or 15 minutes a spinner bait is going on. When I get when it gets closer to dark I'm gonna throw a buzz bait and possibly a popper or something else like that but starting out with that floating minnow then I'm gonna go straight to a spinner bait if I'm not catching anything and we'll go from there. So stay tuned, let's see if I get anything. Let's do it, we're here. Don't step on the snake. I'm going to throw down here for a couple minutes unless I see a snake, in which case I'm not see a few ripples. I'm really hoping that there's something down here. Never know. There could be or there may not be. It's hit and miss right here at the bridge because this is of course where everybody stops to fish. Alright. Time to make a move. I'm going to walk back around this way I'm not technically afraid of snakes I just definitely don't want to walk up on one because especially around water it's probably going to be poisonous so if I can see it before it sees me that would be great Huge bird standing whoa standing on a see that huge bird wow there's two carp right there they're huge Let's see if I can catch them they're absolutely huge oh not gonna be able to catch them they're going where are they going Seriously, I have no idea how to catch a carp, so I don't know what bait to use or anything. It didn't look very interested in my bait, so I'm going to go ahead and move on. Try not to waste too much time. Those things are actually, you know what? I'm going to try casting from this direction in here. Time to move on. really wish I could catch one of those carp but I have no clue how to fish for carp. I have no clue where they went either but man I wish I could catch one. I guarantee you one's right there because there's a lot of wake. Man this is really grown up. Let's just make a cast. Probably get hung up but you know. Alright I'm gonna keep walking. really don't want to get on a snake. Wow, that bird just scared the crap out of me. This is so grown up since last time I was here. Oh, something big is right there. You're going to get eat up by mosquitoes, I can already tell.
Oh, it's a carp. It's right there at that tree. It's like orange colored. No clue how to fish for these things. It's gotta be. All right, I'm gonna continue moving. Can't waste all my time on a carp that's not gonna eat my bait because I don't have the right bait on. Let's see. Can I go that way? Man, shut up. Ah, there's a snake right there. I almost stepped on it. You guys see it? I almost stepped where that snake is. That's why I don't like this place. Right there. Right there. Oh no, I don't want to hook you, buddy. Yeah, almost stepped on it. Dang it. That is not what I like to see. Because that snake was straight up chilling. Getting ready to bite me. Probably. Nah, it probably wouldn't have bit me, but if I had stepped on it, it would have. <sighs> Let's try to catch a fish. I know for a fact they will bite spinner baits. I'm going to try to get a bite on this little minnow, but I am not afraid of changing lures quickly. All right, moving along. Try to keep my eyes open. Hey ducks, I'm not gonna mess with you. Chilling in a puddle. Oh, something just tried to hit it. I don't think it was one of those carp, but maybe it was. God, what is that? Oh, what was that? Almost looked like a bass. Somebody flipped out their flop. The fish are definitely trying to bite today. Oh, I got something. It's pulling kind of like a bowfin, but you just never know. Oh, that's a big bass. Nice. Nice. Awesome. That's what I like to see. Nice healthy bass. Awesome. Probably about two pounds. I'm not gonna take the time to weigh it just because I'm trying to hurry. But awesome. That's what I like to see. Alright, so that's one nice healthy bass out of here. Let's see if I can catch any more. Got another one. That's a little bass. It's probably what was playing with the minnows and stuff down there is this little one. Nice. I should have come down here for my challenge. I thought this place would be flooded like crazy. Nice. All right, little dude. Thank you. I appreciate it. Just a little one, but they're a lot of fun. All right, that's two out of this spot. See if I can make it there. I have a feeling that these bass came down here when it flooded and got trapped. So now there's probably quite a few of them down here and they got trapped. Which I hate it for them, but because they're going to get annihilated down here by the people. Because people don't care. They'll keep big ones, little ones, which, you know, whatever, but they have no preservation skills at all. I have a feeling a little closer to dark, a popper. It's going to be the ticket. All right, I'm going to move on. Move on down. Let's do this. All right, I'm going to move on. I don't have much time, so I'm just going to keep moving. Willing to bet most of y'all don't even know what these are. There's multiple. Y'all know what that is? Especially you young people. There's another one over here. VHS. Yeah. Young people don't know nothing about that. Oh, so, oh got something. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? <laughs> that was the smallest bluegill ever. <laughs> wow. Wow. 
that was funny. This lure was literally blue, bigger than that bluegill. Alright, trying to decide if I want to put the spinnerbait on or if I want to just go straight to the popper. Oh, got something. Oh, it's taking drag. Oh. Don't get me in anything. Uh, it's a blackfish. It's a big one. All right, come on, buddy. I know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get you back in. Nope, nope, nope. I'm going to put you back in. I promise. I promise, dude. I promise. I know I got you dirty. I'm going to put you back in. I promise. I just want to... I don't want to get stuck by your teeth. Oh, God, you piece of shit. All right, you stay. So, my fires right here. All right, dude, just calm down. I promise I'm going to put you back very shortly. All right, there we go. See, this way this booger weighing real quick. That might be the biggest one I've caught out of here. Let's see. Hold still. I'm going to put you back, buddy. I promise. 388. 388. That's a, uh, a pretty big one. I'm going to um, measure him real quick just to get a little measurement. Let's see if he'll sit still. All right, he's right at about 22 inches. All right, buddy. I told you I'm gonna put you back. I promise I am. You good? Thanks. <laughs> Thanks a lot. That looks like I peed in my pants. All right. Whew, that was a good fight. I love them for their fight. I don't love them for their teeth. Oh, I got something. It's running. And it's a bluegill. Actually, it's a Crappy. Yep, it's a crappy. Okay, so lure the fish. Makes sense, right? Whatever. Alright, I think this is gonna be my last spot and I'm gonna turn around and go back. Because I don't have my cell phone. I forgot it at home. I have my gun, but I don't have <laughs> spider whip. I don't have my cell phone. So if something was to happen. I have no way to call anybody because I'm a dummy and I forgot my phone. So I don't want to stay back here. There's a turtle. Oh, is there something wrong with it? Oh, I think he's dead. Oh, that's sad. Poor turtle. That thing demolished it. Wow. So I contemplated throwing the popper, but the only thing about it is that popper is a cheap one from Walmart that would probably break if I hooked into something big. So I'm just going to keep this on and pray. And I'm going to try to keep it at the surface. Gosh, that thing demolished it. That was a pretty big one, too. Not as big as the first one, but... Let's just put the popper on. Let's just put it on. If, if something breaks it off, I'll know next time to 
use a more expensive one. So here's this. <coughs> oh, I could use a buzz bait. Huh. You know what? Let's just do that. They're going to demolish this too, but that's all right. All right, so let's just use this buzz bait. It has a trailer hook on it. So I can get all the short strikes, guys. Yeah, let's do that. Carpet's back. Oh, got something. Little bass. Oh, I tell you, these river fish, they freaking destroy it. Seriously? Seriously, dude. Come on, man. Now that he's dirty, uh, I suck at life. Okay, so there you go. Um, this one is at least two pounds. I'm not going to take the time to weigh him because I really want to catch that carp. Not that that carp will bite it, but I knew there was a bass over there. So here you go, buddy. Can't get the carp to bite. Oh, cannot get those carp to bite. So you guys, I'm gonna rely on you guys to tell me what will a carp bite, because I really wouldn't mind catching one of them. Let's see. Yeah, you know what? If I catch a fish, I'm gonna fall. That's okay. I'll, I'll take that fall. Yeah, how about that? How about that? I'm telling you boys, y'all better watch out. Let's do another tournament. Because, because I'm telling you, this is just, I am just smashing it. Now we have a one-eyed fish because of my buzz bait. Look at that. That's, that's the, literally, seriously. All right, dude, well, I appreciate it. yet again. can't believe I forgot my dog on cell phone. Whoa, that's some deep. Whoa, whoa, my shoe. My, my foot that my boot. My boot got stuck. My boot's stuck in the mud. Dang it. Okay, let's keep moving. I like to throw from both directions if I'm fishing somewhere. I'll try to throw from both directions if I can, just in case I miss somebody and they want to bite it coming from the other direction. Gosh! Don't know what it was, but it tried. It's right there. It's a blackfish. Look at it looking at me. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Tried to hit it again. Oh, he'll hit it again. I guarantee you that. Got him. Ah, oh, he came off. <laughs> again. I bet you will. Well, now I know that, in fact, blackfish will hit, or both in, whatever you want to call them. They will hit. Although he liked it when it was not on top. That's funny. <laughs> Got something. Oh, 
definitely a buff hand. See it's rolling. Alright, let's get on up here, buddy. And I'll let you go. Another nice bow fan. Dang. Alright. Well, I answered my own question. Stop, dude. I'm going to let you go. I promise. Just let me get my stuff out. Stay right there. Alright. Preppers. So that you will not thrash around. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Okay. Hold on. Stay right there. Um... Dang, I got him in the eye. God dang it, Heather. <clears throat> Dude, seriously? I don't want to hook in me. I'm trying as hard as I can to get it out. You got to chill out, though. Open, open that mouth up. I'm trying, buddy. I'm trying. I'm sorry. I don't think I... Didn't get him in the eye. All right, just a real quick wait. I just want to see how much he weighs. These are some nice size ones today, especially out of this little creek. All right. All right. Three, five, nine. All right. Another over three pound. Ah, both in. All right, buddy. There he is. He's gonna go. Promise. Dude, what the hell? He's playing dead. There we go. All right. So I answered my own question. Would will both ends get top water? Yes. Yes, they will. Pretty ferociously too. Would be nice to get a bass, but so that means there are several big bow fin that are just trapped in this area sucks because i mean unless the water gets high again they're just they're not gonna be able to get out so it really does suck mm -mm, mm -mm. that ain't no good that ain't no good at all Now, how am I going to get my rod over there? Please don't fall in the water. I mean, you do what you got to do, right? playing in the bush. Oh, my line broke. Alright. Only because I'm stubborn. I'm tie it back on. I'll come over here and cast a few times and then I'm done. Because I am not trying to walk in here in the dark. No, 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 no. Mother of God. There's really no way I'm getting that. Mother. Shit. I just don't see there being any way for me to go get that. And breaking a root not happening. Oh. Dang it!
Well, that sucks. You know what? That's my cue to go home. That is my cue to just, just go home. That's that's the Lord saying, Heather, why don't you just go home? It's late. You don't need to be out here by yourself. Just go home. You know what? I'm gonna listen. And I'm gonna pray that my my buzz bait will be over there when I come back next time. But yes, Lord, I'm going home. That sucks. Alright, going home. Alright, I'm at my house. Decided to do an outro here because I'm tired of the dark outros that I've been doing lately. Um, because it's been dark whenever I've stopped fishing. But today was awesome. Today was an awesome day. That is the most fun I've had fishing at the creek in a really long time. You can see how wet my shirt is. It's how hot and humid it is out there um, right now. It's going to be in the 80s, close to 90 every day this week. I'm not going to get to go fishing every day, but you know that's okay. I had a great day today. Those bowfin are a lot of fun. I wish I had not lost my freaking buzz bait. That makes me so mad. Um, but it's just not worth it. There probably would have been five snakes over there um, on that side of the creek. Cause it's a lot there's a lot more vegetation and not many people go over there so i would not trust it to go over there um if i had some waders some hip waders or something maybe i'd try it but i'm just not gonna chance it but i had a great day i hope you guys enjoyed this video it has been it was awesome today like i said is the best day i've had fishing in a long time you guys comment down below and let me know what i can use to catch those carp i would love to catch one catch it release it good to go I just would really love to catch a carp. So you guys comment below, tell me what you think I should use to catch those carp. If you like the video, hit the thumbs up, subscribe if you have not already. Thanks for watching, I really appreciate it, and make sure you grab life by the fish. <laughs>